It became really important to me to be involved in the health of my streams, but also I really wanted to pass that knowledge on to the children. This whole state is full of running water everywhere you look. It's just not an ugly piece of land in the whole state of West Virginia. But Fayette County in particular is, to me, the prettiest county in the state. This area where I live, I think is exceptional because of its rivers. The New River is an, a famous river. It's one of the largest rivers on the East Coast. The Gauley River is famous whitewater. This whole state is full of running water everywhere you look. But we have more people than ever right now, I think, interested in clean water. We haven't really got started on this pipeline stuff. So if they're gonna run it, which they are, let's make sure they do it right. Let's make sure we protect our rivers and streams. The Elk, the Gauley, and the Greenbrier are three of the most major rivers in this state. We need people out there watching it and talking about it and, 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 and calling FERC, telling them what they think. So cool. It is so cool. This stuff, I'm such a nerd. I love this stuff. For our program here in West Virginia and Virginia, we partner with the West Virginia Rivers Coalition, and we look at where the best, high, highest quality water and best trout water we have, and where that's overlapped by gas pipelines or shale gas extraction. And we try to find neighboring communities where there could be volunteer bases that we can reach out to and engage in the programs. Our goal really is to get folks out there in advance of development, collecting regular uh, monthly data to establish a solid baseline of water quality conditions. You know, if development does occur in the area, we have that baseline and we also have an active group that can go out to these streams and be the eyes and ears on the ground, keeping an eye on, on the streams and making sure that, you know, if there is a pollution event, we identify it and we can report it appropriately to make sure it's taken care of. Augusta County is a county that um, water does not flow into. It only flows out of Augusta County. This is where rivers start. And to have this area especially, uh, have, to have the threat of contamination here I, is to me just madness. This water not only supplies the water in our area, but it's used in other parts of the state and it's used even as far as Washington, D.C. The only thing that I know that I can do as a citizen is to monitor this water and to make sure it remains as pure as it's been. I grew up in Rockingham County for part of my very small childhood, actually very close to the forest, so did quite a bit of stream stomping as a child, um, looking for critters under rocks and such. I want to make sure, you know, that future generations have that opportunity as well and that we don't mistreat our streams to the point that there's a possibility or a reason to be scared of them from contamination. I feel like I'm helping to make sure that that's not the case.